Afternoon guys, Tony back again, Horrin Todd, how you all doing? Got a parcel here, got a couple of parcels. Got my parcel for my um, media books I've been saying. Uh, been saying it for about a week now that I'm going to get these. So I'm going to open it with you guys and show you. It's uh, a package from Germany. So I've got quite a few. And um, been looking forward to these because there's some decent titles. And one that I don't know, really understand what it is, but we'll see. We'll see in here. You'll understand what I mean. So I'm just cracking this package open. I hope everyone's good. I went to Nottingham yesterday. So I've got another FOP uh, unboxing to not unboxing, um, showing you what I got from FOP. That sort of thing. So I'll show you show you this one first. So first things first, it is I got Clive Barker's Lord of Illusions, which is an awesome awesome film if you haven't seen it. And uh, got the English language. Yeah, I think. We have, and uh, yeah, this is a real, real good film. I haven't seen it for a long time. I can just remember, I remember it from the VHS days. Uh, so I've got this one, which is Blu-ray. So the thick, thick media book from the MGM. So that's Lord of Illusions. Thought that was cool. I got this one because it reminded me of um, a VHS. That I used to get freaky fairy tales. And I used to get this when I was a kid. I can remember this exact, and I can just remember it being dead time stories. A lot, so you can see my reflection. It's really good. What a fit, what a, like cheesy sort of stuff. It's all in German on the back, but yeah, I thought I'd try that again. Uh, two disc limited edition. Let's crack this open, shall we? Get rid of this horrible. Horrible glare. What do we give? We'll have a look. So yeah, it's that lot. Dead time stories. And uh, some nice stills on here. That's it. You get a uh, uncut. And that's one cut two DVD and that's your Blu-ray. So yeah, I just love this cover art, so I thought I've got to get that. I've got as you can see here. A lot of people have been getting this, The Hitcher, which is an awesome film. Uh if you haven't watched this guys, it's I haven't seen it for a long time. But yeah, really looking forward to this. It's got an uncut version on it, and I've think if I'm right it might be the first time on blu-ray so yeah pick that one up it's really good I'll open a few of these as we go along but got this film this is an amazing film Once Were Warriors you guys in Australia and that will know what this is as well this is um free disc limited collector's edition and this is an amazing brutal film like um it's in New Zealand, in like um, as we call it in England, like a like a estate, like really rough. This guy's really tough, and you got his son, who's like a Maori, and he like joins a gang, and he has to get his son back. So, yeah, it's um, I like this film. I haven't watched it for many of year, but let's have a look in it, shall we? But yeah. I thought I've got to get this because I haven't even got it on bloody DVD or Blu-ray. I can't believe it. I used to watch this all, all the time around my cousin's house. I used to watch Once Warriors when I was little. I used to love it. But... Let's have a look inside, guys. Sorry. All fingers. I've just come back from work. so Let's have a look at this free disc collector's edition. 
So it's just um, it's got like a bit of paper on the front, and we got that one. We got the wife. That's the main guy. He's tough as nails. He is. I can't remember his name now. Been on a lot of things though. Just can't. And you got like the gangs, his family. Can't remember if someone gets killed or something, but got a DVD, bonus DVD. So you got it's a real good addition, probably one of the best editions out there, I should think. But yeah, that's like a piece of paper, look, just covering it over. But once the warriors, it's awesome. I've got this amazing film, as you can see. Uh, Castle Freak. This is amazing. Haven't watched this for years. I know. Um, Good friend, uh, Jason, uh, JM, Horrific Nightmares, JM loves this film. It's one of his favourites. So we'll have a look at this. But that's the back, guys, Castle Freak. I'm hoping it's got English audio. Yeah, because I don't check these out sometimes. And then I'm, um, I thought I haven't watched it before. But you know what, coming to think about it, I think I have a long time ago. But it's really good media book, this one. Uh, Wicked Vision. I said, I'm, I'm not too clued up on media books. Not like um, Roasted Schools over there. He knows his stuff. But I don't really know that many companies and stuff. And that's why I get caught out sometimes. With, so you get the this bit on it, which is always cool. Lovely media book. Wicked artwork. And you get the Blu-ray, you get the DVD. It's got all sorts in here. But obviously it's in German, but yeah, I think that's amazing. Castle Freak. Um, next one. Now, oh, looking forward to this. This is the Wanderers. We'll crack this open. Because look, you must know what the Wanderers is. Everyone does, surely. Like a gang film. Wicked cult film. One of the probably one of the best gang films with the porkies, and another one I've seen which was um, oh, I've talked about it before. It's called Deadbeat at Dawn. That was amazing. But this is a uh, wonders I got put in my mind um, the other week when uh, Grant, the horror fan man, he got a version of the Wanderers. I don't know if it was this one. I can't remember. I don't think it was. Um, from Germany, a media book, and I was like the Wanderers. I remember. I need that in my life. So I got this one. It's like one of the thick padded squidgy with a Wanderers shirt. It's all embossed. Like spot gloss on the back. That's what's on the back of the shirts. I need one of these shirts in my life. So you get the Blu-ray. And I think you get bonus features under DVD. But this, guys, no no real picture in here. But look, I can't wait to watch this again. I haven't watched this movie for years, but... That's an awesome addition, really is. So that's another cool one. Um, I got this. Saw Roasted Schools Open Edition oh, a bit ago. Headless. Now I haven't actually watched this yet, but I just heard it's really brutal and really strange and fucked up, which is right up my alley. So yeah, he got the one with the guy's uh, face all ripped off, but I got this version for you know, headless, it's meant to be really strange, uh, that's the back guys, it's German obviously, but you got, um, I'm hoping you've got English audio on here, yeah you have there, look, here in the bottom, bottom left corner you know, English, Dolby, English, so yeah, we've got, that's, that's the one he got with the, um, with the uh, cover on it, they're roasted scores, but yeah. So you get the Blu-ray and the DVD. Really cool edition. Amazing media book. That's the spine. So that's headless. Um, couple more. I got this one. Fly to the Navigator. Haven't watched this for years. 30th, 30th anniversary edition. This is an amazing movie. 
Brings back childhood memories. Yeah, got the English on here a lot. So that's good. Looks awesome. This was only cheap. This was like eight eight pounds or something. So you get DVD and Blu-ray. Not going to open this one, but you know what flight the flight the Navigators is. Really good edition. One more in here, guys. And it is brilliant prison film. Love it. Stallone. Lock up. Brilliant film. Donald Sutherland in here. Sly. And it's just a brilliant prison movie. I love it. I'm hoping it's got English. Yeah, I think it does. Yeah, here at the bottom. Yeah, we've got English on here. So yeah, I love Lock Up, Stallone. I thought I've got to get that. Got to get that. So that's them ones, guys. Uh, I got this Hellraiser set from them as well. It's like um, a box. It was only like ten quid, and I think it's for. Now I love Hellraiser, and I've got lots of editions, so I'm gonna have to. It's for the Hellraiser trilogy. Look, you got Hellraiser, Hellbound. But you don't actually get the DVDs, you just get like, so you get like, a, it's like a box. Let me see if I can crack it open for you. Sorry, let me get, so you get a box, and it's like, it's, like limited, it's like a limited edition thing. So you've got your, um, what are they called? Like your, uh, it's like, um, a still shot of the film. This is number 380 on that side. You can't really see it because I can't really hold it up to the light. I'm not moving my phone. But you get that and you get all posters and stuff. They're all posters of each film. And they're like lament configuration stuff. So yeah, I thought for 10 quid, I thought I've got to get that. Nice hard box. You got that. I thought I was going to be lucky and get the films with it, but they want actually the films. So that's my media books, guys. I've got a parcel from off eBay. Let's have a look at this. Move that one out of the way. This is off eBay. I've just to uncut it. Let's have a look. So I've got a DVD, kickboxer box set, kickboxer one and two. Um... This was a pound off eBay. So, I oh, like a fighting film. So that's all right for a pound. And then I got Stitches for two pound, brand new. I haven't actually watched this here. Who did he hear talking about? Maybe Andrew Ballner said it was a decent clown movie. That's that one. So for two pound, brand new, and a pound, three pound for them too. Free postage and all. I don't know how they afford it, to be fair. Three pound, but... Mental in it. That's those. That's them. One more package. A guy off face, uh, off a group off Facebook that I follow. It was, I think this was thirteen pound for three Blu-rays. I can't actually remember what I got, but it was over over a week ago, and he said he was going to be a bit of time sending it. So no problem, mate. It's on holiday or something at working or something. But we'll have a look. And yeah, I'll show you. Sorry it's a bit messy, guys, but it's easy to do it like this. So we got... Here we go. Uh... Five Dolls for August Moon. For an August Moon. I'll never watch this. Nice thick book. Uh, don't think I've got this one. No. I haven't. So that was good. So I got these three for £13. So that was good. That was on Frankenstein the Monster from Hell. I talked about this. It was brand new. I love this one. I've talked about this before. Really good movie. It's got two disc set as well, this is. Peter Cushion, obviously. And that's the monster this time. It's awesome. And another Hammer Horror, brand new. 
Twins of Evil. Peter Cushion. This is a good uh, good Hammer movie with the two twins. I can't remember what the name is now. Mary and Madeline Coulson. Two twins. And they're like, yeah, they become vampires. And Peter Cushion's like... Um, like a witch hunter type, you know, thing. But they turn into vampires. But really good movie. I saw, who was it? Grumpy Andrew. He'd done a review. I don't know if he's done it yet. But he definitely watched the trailer. And it is an awesome movie. So I thought, those three. £13 delivered. Through the, obviously, he didn't charge me delivery. So that was those. So that's it, guys. Uh, that's my media book stuff. That's my bits I've got today. I'm going to do another one tomorrow. I'll keep it for tomorrow for you. I haven't done it yet. Of all the stuff I picked up from FOP yesterday in Nottingham. Picked up a load of Arrow titles again. I've got nearly all the Arrow titles now that's in there. I'm sure I have. Not many more to get. Um, but yeah. So that's that guys. Tell me what you think. If you've seen any of these movies. If you like any of them. I think there's all cool additions. So yeah. All good fun. All the fun's over now. Got to wait a bit longer. But yeah. Thanks a lot, guys. We'll catch you in a bit.